Uh, hello and welcome back. So today I thought I'd do something a little bit different. Uh, I'm going to make a volcano. So I just wanted to show how it starts. So I'm going to dig this right down. Oh, I only have a trap frilly. So I'm going to dig this right down and then I'm going to dig it right up as, as high as I can go. And then it's going to come out on all sides. So it'll just look like a, a volcano in the ground out here in the desert um, then what I'm going to do is fill it up with uh, well some red flowers down the bottom along with those uh, the gems red gems um, that you get in the mine I forgot what they call them and they'll be down the bottom just to look like you know like lava or something and then I'll put some uh, probably flowers up top coming down so it's like uh, you know lava coming down flowing out so what I'll do is I'll just get into uh, digging this out. I may have to get him out or just kill him. All right, let's uh, dig this out. like as far as we can go then hopefully I can get out should be able to shouldn't I Should I dig dig my way up <laughs> but I had to put one little step there so to raise this up I guess we'll see how far up we can go just do one side for now So that's about as high as we can go. So see if we can, oh, we can bring it up from here. That's awesome. Gotta watch I don't break these. Let me finish this and uh, we'll come back and then we can do all the rest the same. So I've got to work out exactly how it's going to come down on each side. It's going to be almost like a pyramid with a big hole in the middle, I guess you could say. But try and make it, you know, round. Alright, 
right so uh, before i fill it up and do the edges i'm oh, sorry and can't get out i will actually organize all these so these are going to act like the lava inside the pit and when you look down at night they do actually glow quite nicely make sure they're not all floating and then i've got some red flowers just to mix it up a little bit so it's like a flaming fire so i don't know just to add more red <laughs> A little bit of green there though but uh i guess that should do it i have to go get some more of these they're still floating oh that should do so when you look down especially at night it does glow quite nicely oh yeah and then i was going to put these in these give it a nice little soft burny glow as well Really just like that definitely look better at night and then I'll just fill in the wall gotta work out where to do it though how far I go out Now I have to work out the edges. How am I going to do the edges? It's going to be like, like I said, like a circle, but it's just going to be like all over the place. It doesn't have to be symmetrical. So yeah, it just be all over the place. There's no form in it, formality to it or anything. Maybe make it a little higher, I'm not too sure yet. But this edging here has to go all the way up as well. Oh, I didn't mean that one. All 
I gotta charge these up again. They just get used up so fast. I don't want to use any more they're going to break any second now so i'll have to go put these in charge and i will be back okay so i've done a little bit more uh just testing out some theories putting this rock on top so i've got all that inside and uh some more torches so at night that actually glows really nicely in the daytime not so much so now I just have to go around and lift up all the dirt around the side. Sort of like this. Uh, it doesn't have to be too uniform as I was saying. Just got to make it look messy. And then see if we can put these rocks on and then some lava coming out. Like it's falling down. charge them up again and I'll be back okay so I've done some more um, but yeah, we just have to keep going fill up the edges I'll put some rocks on top get the wolf, uh, lights down there the flaming torches I need some more rubies to put down there though not enough at the moment it does look good at night time though but uh, yeah so we we'll just have to do a little bit more here just to fill it out a little more. I'll put these stones and the rocks on top. We'll change the color of the dirt. We'll make it look a lot better and stand out from the rest of this uh, dirt around here in the desert. Well, you can't do too much with the printer, can you? I have to put this one on charge very soon too. All right, I don't want to break that one either, so we'll go put them on charge and... Uh, We'll keep going and we'll come back, finish it. Pass it up again. Uh, let's uh, do some more. we just got a little bit more to go just need to fill in all the edges and then put the stone on it and then we're almost done
Is this how they built the pyramids? <laughs> There's no uniformity to this, it's just all over the place. But I want it to be somewhat realistic. <laughs> Right, do I have any more? One more. That's it. Gotta make sure I don't break any more. I had to borrow some opals off spec. Thank you, spec. <laughs> I have to repay her with that though. charge them and uh, we'll have to finish a couple more little things along here Still a little bit more to go all right I'll be back uh, I think I've pretty much done what I wanted to do around the outside maybe, maybe a little bit more here and there but we'll start putting some rock on it I guess as well Alright, let's see what we put this uh, rock path on now. Oh, I definitely need more. And I want to put some of these rock path edges on as well just to change it up a little bit that's it oh, I'm gonna have to go make some more uh, we'll do a quick flyby and see what it looks like now yeah, it definitely looks a little bit better with the rock around it So we just finish off these uh, rock paths around the place. Just, just put it all over the place and make it look like it's earth coming out of the volcano. I'll leave some plain. these flowers down see what it looks like if it's uh, can be decent enough for like a lava flow or something unless I need to put the rubies here or something Something like that. Mm. 
it will definitely look good from a distance. So let's go have a look. Maybe I have to put some rubies there as well. I mean, the whole thing sort of blends into the ground, doesn't it? <laughs> Unless I put some grass around the edge just to, to define it. I don't want to get rid of these trees here, though. I don't want any of this here. So what I might do is go get some grass. I'll clear all this out. I'll come back and put some grass in when it's daytime. All right, so I'm just going to put some grass around. Not too much, just a little bit around the edges, just to define the volcano. I want to put some more of these trees, uh, bush, or these flowers. So there's a piece along here, it goes all the way into the water. But we'll see. I'll just use up all this grass. grass and trees there it should look good I guess we'll get an aerial shot may clean it up a little bit later once I figure out what else we can do with it what else would look good on it but for now there's the volcano look deep inside and I guess you could call that lava <laughs> it look good at night we'll have a look at night night time so I'll come back at night and uh, we'll do another little flyby as well watch uh, I'll put some lights there hopefully at night time that will light up the red I couldn't put it on the flowers but uh, let's have a look So that should be about the darkest we can get. I don't think it'll get any darker. So let's have a little flyby of it at night time. like from a distance too huh?
that should be it. All right, thank you very much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, we've got some more videos coming very shortly. Thank you.